Hello and welcome to Rudy's Retro Intel. On today's show, we'll be looking at the Apple II Plus series computer and determine the most common video problems that they face and something that you can easily fix. So stay tuned and let's peek inside and poke around. <laughs> Okay, so I've opened up the case on the Apple IIe and I've removed the cards. I've also removed the screws to save you some boring video. And let's take a look inside this IIe and see the most common problems that IIe's, IIe's have and II Pluses or other computers that use the same video connector, which is the main problem here. So on our screen, we've just turned the computer on. I am getting a red light that's getting power. I hit control reset. I can type, I hear bang, bings, but no video. So let's op take the case, uh, bet before we take the case off, let me see if I can zoom in here and show you what the problem is. So if I zoom in, uh, let us see there, you can sort of see it there. This here is has the video, if I touch this, this connector gets broken or loose. See, we can see video now. Now we don't. So let's open it up and take a better look inside to show you exactly what I mean. So to remove the case, take the screws off and you have to unplug the keyboard connector. Now the just interesting thing about the keyboard connector is that if you power on the 2E without the keyboard plugged in, what will happen is that you'll get the built-in diagnostics running and that will uh, do a diagnostics of the computer. Now the keyboard will fail because there is no keyboard attached, but um, in a pinch, if you want to see if the machine is working properly, just unplug the keyboard. If you don't know the, the uh, proper combination for the keys, uh, which you can do is, I believe it's open Apple, close Apple, control reset. Um, it'll go into the diagnostics mode, but if you don't wear, remember that, you can just unplug the keyboard. Okay, I was able to get the camera to do proper focusing, and now we can actually show you what the heck is going on here. So people plug their cables in and they twist it, and as you see, this connector is, there we go, see how it's moving? this center piece here needs to connect to there and what happens by twisting it and turning it it breaks off now it looks like someone has put a solder blob right here and that prevents it from turning but either it's not working properly which i don't think the blob is taken um, so we'll touch that up and, and we'll try that out but this is the most common problem you're going to find on the two series computers with bad video so let's heat up the iron and take a look. Okay, now that we've plugged everything back in, uh, let's turn it on and see what happens. Now, in this case, the video should come up and because the keyboard is not, is not plugged in, we should go right into the Apple IIe diagnostics. Let's see if that happens. Oh, there we go. We got a picture. And we got this colors. It's doing its thing, its magic. And we should hear some beeps at the end and uh, get a display on the condition of the computer. In this case, we are not getting that um, OK uh, kernel or OK, OK system because the keyboard is not plugged in. So it's saying, oh, there's still a problem with the computer. But I'm confident enough that the video is good. So let's plug the keyboard back in and see what happens. Plug the keyboard in here. Okay, keyboard's plugged in. Let's take a let's get another shot. Ah, and there we go. We have the Apple, the famous Apple II screen. Now, to get to the um, onboard diagnostics, oh, looks like it's working. Yep. 
uh, close Apple, open Apple, close Apple, control reset. There we go. So that's going to run the onboard diagnostics again. And hopefully this time it's going to pass because the keyboard's plugged in. Let's give it a moment while it does its little song and dance in color here. system okay that means we're good so there you have it that's how we fix the most common apple 2e 2 plus and 2c video problems so if you have one or you get one and you're hearing beeps but you're not getting video or you're not getting any video with no beeps maybe the speakers unplugged broken who knows if you're getting a problem first thing to do is open it up look at that connector and take a look very closely to see if it's disconnected if it is solder the middle middle pin solder put some a solder blob along the edge so it stops it from twisting and give it a shot hope you enjoyed this thank you for coming and a big thanks to all my new subscribers and we'll see you soon